People of God, I didn't even know that Perez's name was used to compose a song. Honestly speaking, guys, that song is very, very interesting. At your own leisure, you can go to streaming platform to stream the song. Or more, it is so, so amazing. Like, I really enjoyed it. And the, being that it was composed using Perez's name, or more, ah, it gave me this level of enjoyment. I was just like, ah, ah. Uh uh Pere, you are going places so anyways guys a lot of people are now talking about pere 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 if you go on train table if you go on social media um now pere they rain for dear like say tomorrow no day and the reason why he is raining and trending there is because um pere is now doing things with who's who in nollywood industry in other words we can say pere is now rubbing shoulder with Cream de la cream, people that matters, best of the best in Nollywood industry, almost the kind of big deal that Pere landed himself this time around, Omo, he really gave his fan a serious bragging. Guys, let's just get right into the video because we are in for another interesting hodges too. Fina finally decided to get a man. <laughs> hey, wahala, wahala, wow. Ladies and gentlemen, make Ona see the reason why she finally wants to get a boyfriend, a serious boyfriend for herself. But trust Finishon to always buy me pantambra. I trust them to buy me pantambra. Look at them buying me sexy thing as if I have man that I want to wear it for. Because of the fact that she is always being gifted pant and bra. In fact, designers pant and bra by her fans. And because of the fact that she does not have any man that she is wearing it for, she has made up her mind that she is definitely going to hook a man. She is going to get a serious man that she will be wearing all of those sexy things that Finition are getting her. And guys, because she made the information public, it actually generated a whole lot of reaction as some people that wanted to taunt her with Groovy get a dose of Fina's medicine. Meanwhile, guys, no bit smart, you know, the way Ilebaye beat Doin and Kositwala of Big Brother Titans, including others, the way she defeated them, guys, it really generated a whole lot of traffic. Ladies and gentlemen, watch to the end of this video. Please, if you are new to this channel and you are contemplating if you are to subscribe or not, I encourage you to please do where to subscribe, click on the notification bell button. Ladies and gentlemen, do not forget to give this particular video a very big thumbs up because in this particular channel, me, I do upload multiple videos daily. They tell on as it take they happen with this, our big brother, Naja celebrity. See? So guys, no be smart, you know, no be smart, you know. Honestly speaking, the way this big brother, Naja children is seriously making big brother proud left and right. Or more big brother wherever he is right now he would just be like yes yes i am the biggest star maker worldwide because or more look at big brother Niger children making him proud here and there like Pere landed himself a very big deal. A very loud one as that like Pere will be featuring in a movie that is sponsored by United Nations. And he will be acting alongside notable cream de la cream who's who best of the best in Nollywood industry. Guys, that is a very, very great news. Like wherever Big Brother is right now, Big Brother will be so, so proud of Pere. Guys, like Big Brother and Niger Children, they are seriously doing absolutely well in the entertainment industry. On to the next gist, guys. No be smart, you know, the way Ilebae fans came through for her to ensure that she wins Celebrity of the Year 2023 during this Africa Women's Awards 2023 as she defeated 
Princess Jakoko, Ama Reginald, Doyin David and Kusitwala of South Africa to emerge as the winner of this category. Although a lot of people have found one or two to say uh, it is because it is um, Doyin and Kusitwala that is there. That is why Ilebaye won that category. What happens to the other category that has bigger Big Brother Niger contender? Guys, like people, you, I don't understand. Like, it makes me sick and wonder why is it that some people in this Big Brother Niger street cannot congratulate someone's win or success without having one or two to say or without trying to say it is because of this or that. Guys, like, it is very, very funny. It is very, very funny to be honest. On to the next gist, guys. Not be smart, you know. Fina, after seeing how she is being shipped up and down by her fans after her picture of she and Oyibuma surfaced online. In fact, a particular fan of hers decided to tell us that now she will be shipping Fina and this Oyibuma that anything where anybody wants to talk, let the person talk. Age is just a number since not all the man where they this life with the ship with Fina, who cares to join this group? So as Fina see this particular one, it really cracked her up so so badly that she decided to took to her Twitter page to tell all of us that CEO as he stands now, since her fans and lovers are seriously shipping her up and down that she has made up her mind that she will be getting a man according to her in the tweet she said she sees that her family base just the ship her with anything that she promised next year she must definitely get a boyfriend but for now aluta continua victoria asata myself i don't try guys this actually generated a whole lot of reaction because if you go under the comment section we see a lot of talking talking we see a lot of you know guys people are seriously reacting in fact a certain finition decided to remind Fina that Shebi you told us earlier that you have a man and uh, Fina said to that particular young lady that asked the question so you go they believe me when I talk say I have a man um, uh, the way Fina really laughed out loud with her laughing emoji, um, uh, it was very, very contagious. Me, myself, I was just like laughing out loud. Like, I think after breaking up with Groovy, Fina decided to like gather her life, work her money, make a name for herself and finally heal properly before jumping into another relationship. Guys, I think that is the best way to understand yourself and understand what you want in a relationship again and the cause of the breakup of the previous one, what you did not do well, what you need to do better. Guys, like it gives you opportunity to like work on yourself, to like know what you are going to expect and what you are going to do how to navigate the next one i think that is the best way to get or to be or to enter into a very very healthy situation or mommy i don't they turn to relationship advisor i'll be relationship counselor right now this year i'll be ending this particular video let me know your thoughts about all of this shower.